but it worked like an hour ago. So somebody has fucking touched it and fucking ruined it. Oh, this is gonna be this. Yeah, is sure. gonna be I'm um, actually playing my songs yeah. everywhere. That's so, so dope, man. You just cruising around playing your stuff? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. And uh, like to anyone who wants to listen. And maybe some people who don't want to listen to. <laughs> we'll see. Some cool stuff around here, right? There's some cool stuff, man. Yeah. Which, have you got a favorite yet? Uh, yeah, I think so. I got caught on the, the bird over, uh, it's a black and white painting, okay. and there's like a, a bird sitting on a stick, sticking out of some sort of bush. It's just, it caught my eye. It's great. I'll check you out in a bit, right? Cool. Very shallow relationships with humans, um, and more recently, as my, my health has become worse, I started to move on to issues of mortality and eternity. So I'm killing the cat, which of course is an animal you associate with a lot of life, with pleasure, with sex, with so on. But because all living things eventually pass away, and in contrast, that which doesn't <laughs> live, that which yeah. is that which is an animal, that which is eternal, endures forever. So I've okay, got this contrast here, and uh, you may recognise some other included lines from William Blake, um, the poet. And so I'm trying to, you, and so my hope is that I don't just stir the heart, but I also stir the head. Again, to think about the connections and how these images evolve. I mean, you talk for hours about just the relationship between these two or these two. Um, so that's what I do. Of course, this I hope resonates to all artists, but at some level, we're all tricksters. We're all we live on the, on the boundary of society and trying to break the social rules to affect change. I like one with the cats, though. Well, that's, that's more about, say, um, my health isn't great, and uh, I should be talking about my pale skin tone. And um, I wanted to exp this I wanted to explore, say, the theme, themes of mortality versus eternity, and celebrated life and all its joys versus being static and safe and not win your life, but love but enjoying. You know, is it better to save a life and burn out, or is it better to retire to retire to a safe stone cave and endure? So what do we think? What do I think? Yeah, what's the bill? Well, I don't have a choice. I'm going to be dead in a year anyway. <laughs> Brain cancer. Um, and my, I'll go blind and stop being able to do all this before then. So... That has something uh, to it, actually. I, I, was, I was a bit worried that this might just end up being shot factor, you know, dead cat. 
I didn't want to do that, but... Um, I like the way it's there, and uh, it's kind of uh, judgmental. Yeah. Well, I, I, as Blake put it, Tiger Tiger burning bright. Yeah. It's not a very friendly kind of system. No. Right, it's...